What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video today. I want to talk about silver looking like it's about to hit $20 an ounce. I also want to talk about being able to get silver at spot before the price continues to climb. And I also want to talk about a brand new coin that I've never owned before that I just ordered last night. But really quick, just in case you're new, make sure to subscribe for daily videos. Also subscribe to my second channel, which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content. Brand new video over there, go check it out. The link will be in the description, trying to hit 2,000 subscribers. And if you wanna help support the channel by getting some DYDSS merchandise, of course we have some precious metal themed t-shirts and hoodies, which are up for grabs, along with a ton of other products, t-shirts, hoodies, even stickers, many of which are raising funds and awareness for different charity organizations. And of course the brand new Kraken Stackin, inspired by the silver Kraken coin t-shirts, hoodies, stickers, and coffee mugs. Any and all merchandise can be found by clicking the first link in the description section down below. Thank you in advance. It's more than appreciated. But today, I wanted to talk about the spot price of silver because it looks like silver might be hitting $20 an ounce. Last night, silver was $19.51. If you guys watched the video I posted yesterday, I talked about it. I said, hey, silver's at $19.51. You know what that means. Between $19 and $20, it's 51% of the way to 20 bucks. And with that being said, it's more than halfway to $20. Therefore, it's closer to $20 than $19. So who knows? Maybe tomorrow, meaning today, because I posted this yesterday, maybe tomorrow prices will continue to climb. Or maybe they'll drop back down or maybe they'll sit tight right around where they've been. Who knows? Sure enough, that was yesterday. Today when I woke up, I checked the spot price of silver, $19.99. My God, one penny away from the $20 mark. Of course, I refreshed the page after a minute and it dropped down to $19.95. And I got a comment from somebody saying that it actually went to $20 for about 10 minutes or so. I did not see it. I did not read anything about it, so I'm not entirely sure. But silver is practically $20 an ounce right now as I'm recording this video. $20, just about. Not quite there, but it's close enough. It's just about $20. And as I said in yesterday's video, if it hits $20 or goes above $20, I have a feeling that's the last we're going to see Silver Eagles under 30 bucks. I think the premiums are going to continue to climb or at the very least stay as high up as they are. And if the spot price goes up, I think the premium is going to get bumped up above uh, $30 altogether just to pick up one Silver Eagle. That's my expectation anyway. I don't know for sure. Hey, by the way, after I finished filming the video, now that I am editing the video, this happened. I also picked up a little bit of silver last night and today, both online, so they're on the way. They should be here, hopefully, in just a couple of days. But I wanted to talk about something because a lot of people have been looking to get silver for a relatively low premium, and that's something everybody has been scrambling to do right now. The premiums have been astronomical right now. Spot is higher up than what we're used to, and the premiums are through the roof, so it's it's incredibly difficult to stack as much silver as we would ideally like to be able to stack. So I understand the pain. I understand the struggle. I've been going after 90% and generic silver for the last couple of weeks just so I can continue to stack for a lower fiat dollar bill price tag. But somebody told me during my live stream a couple nights ago that a 10 ounce silver starter pack type of thing is back in stock. Now I made a video about different types of silver you can get at spot a couple weeks ago and a lot of people said that they went and checked and by the time I posted the video, the sites were saying that they were out of stock, but this one in particular, back in stock, I ended up getting the silver gold bull bar, the 10 ounce silver bar, obviously I don't have it yet, but the same amount of silver as this right here, 10 ounce silver bar. So. Hopefully by the end of the week or maybe this weekend or early next week, I will be doing an unboxing of the 10 ounce silver bull bar. I'm not getting paid to talk about it. I wanted to let everyone know because a lot of people are scrambling to get silver right now, let alone get silver at spot. That's an opportunity and I don't believe it'll be in stock for very much longer. So silver gold bull, I'll send you an invoice. I'm just kidding. But 
If anybody has not already gotten the 10 ounce bull bar, as I'm recording the video, now there's no guarantee that it will still be in stock by the time I post the video, which is why I'm trying to film and edit this as quickly as I can, but they are currently up for grabs. And when mine arrives, I can prove that. I just ordered one just today, like 20 minutes ago. And I wanted to talk about that because there's a lot of different ways you can get silver at spot. I know a lot of people talk about how their coin shop gives them silver at spot. That's usually not true, but I'm sure some coin shops do that. But online, there's a lot of different like silver starter packs. I know one site over here might offer silver buffalo rounds. This one over here has the silver prospector rounds. This one has a five ounce bar at spot and they're all at spot. And they've been pushing and promoting this starter pack for God knows how long, but they're currently either out of stock or temporarily unavailable. I don't believe many of them are out of stock. I believe they are listed as unavailable just because why would they offer it at spot when people are fearfully paying five, ten dollars over spot for the same piece of silver. So right now it's a whole supply and demand thing. So a lot of those are not currently available. But the silver gold bowl bar is a 10 ounce piece of silver, just like this. It's something that I've been wanting for over a year. I don't know why I never ordered one. I never got around to it. For some reason, I, I don't know what it is. I just, I never ordered one, but I did today. And if it's something that you have not already gotten for yourself, you have the ability to place an order right now if that's what you choose to do i'm not a financial advisor so don't take it as financial advice do whatever you want to do with your money make sure you do your own research first i'm just letting you guys know that they are currently in stock and up for grabs and available and i also wanted to talk about a new type of coin that i picked up it's something that i've briefly been mentioning during my live streams and my last couple of videos because i picked this up the other day, I just posted an unboxing and a little bit of a review of this coin right here. The two ounce Silver Kraken from Canada's Creatures of the North series. It's my very first two ounce coin. And I said that it kind of reminds me of the Queen's Beasts because it's a two ounce increment. And also because obviously Creatures of the North Queen's Beasts, creatures and beasts all oftentimes go hand in hand. So I said that I'm not necessarily a coin collector. I don't really have the plan or intention or the objective to get every coin from the series or from the set or anything like that. I'm not really all that into it, but I am really starting to appreciate the Queen's Beast coins right now. And I said in the last couple videos that I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled. If I stumble upon a Queen's Beast silver coin for a fair fiat dollar bill price tag, obviously that might be a little bit difficult because spot, once again, is up right now. Premiums are definitely up right now. And those carry a higher premium anyway because they're a collectible coin from a series. But if I stumble upon one, and I consider it to be an opportunity, I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled and I might just pick it up. Well, long story short, last night, while I was bouncing around from different sites, I was going from JM Bullion to SD Bullion to Provident Metals to Atmex and eBay and searching through the auctions and the buy it now, and I was looking all over the place, all different sites, I ended up finding one for a pretty decent fiat dollar bill price tag. It was an auction. I waited until there was about 15 seconds left. I placed the highest bid. Then sure enough, somebody else placed a higher bid about one second left and, and won. So I did not win the auction, but I found another one that was a buy it now option, not an auction. It was buy it now with free shipping and still a lower dollar bill fiat price tag than the auction that I just lost. 
So losing ended up being a win because I got another one, a different Queen's Beast coin. I'm not gonna let you know what it is because I'm gonna wait until it arrives in the mail and I can do a, an unboxing video. Normally, if I was able to pick up the silver gold bull bar, which I was just previously talking about, I would keep that a secret too. I like to keep my recent pickups a secret until they arrive, just because it makes the unboxing video a little bit more fun. However, I had to disclose this time around when it came to the 10 ounce silver gold bull bar, just because I feel like that would be a selfish thing to do if I knew that there was a piece of silver that you can get at spot and not let the viewers know. So if that's not a piece of silver that you haven't already picked up, you right now currently have the opportunity to pick it up. And it's one of those things where it's, I believe, one per household. But if you already have the bar, I'm sure you can get a friend or a family member to buy one and have it sent to their house and then you just give them the cash or you PayPal them or, or whatever. I, I'm sure there are plenty of loopholes. There are plenty of ways to figure it out. So if that's something that you're interested in and you already have one and you're disappointed, like, oh, I already have one. I can't get it again. You can get it again in a different way. If you get somebody else to buy it for you and have it sent to their house or PO box or, or somewhere, it's one per customer or one per household, but have somebody else in a different household become the customer and then just give them the cash and they give you the money. Bing, bang, boom, problem solved. That's 10 ounces of silver at spot. So if you pay with a check, it's, or it was about a hundred and $95 or something like that. And if you pay with PayPal, it would have brought it up to, I think, $102. I ended up paying with PayPal just because I get 10% cash back on all of my purchases made through PayPal. So if you do the math, 10% off of what I paid with PayPal was actually less than I'd be paying just with a check and no cash back. So PayPal ended up making more sense. I paid a little bit higher just to get more cash back. And it actually, if you deduct it, it brings it down lower to how much the you know, listing would be if I were to pay with a check or something like that. So that's just what I did. That's how I did it. And you guys know where to go. Silver Gold Bull, 10 ounce silver bar at spot right now. It's actually been available for the last two or three days. I was going to wait until the 21st, but couldn't help myself. It's a silver bar that I've been wanting for a really long time. So I just ordered one a couple minutes ago. And then as for a Queen's Beast, I picked up my very first one. If you guys want to head on down to the comments and take a guess which Queen's Beast coin I picked up, I'm going to leave that up to you guys. If you want to take a guess, you'll figure it out when I do an unboxing video whenever it arrives. But that's all I wanted to say about that couple different things. I know the video was a little bit jumbled. I went from talking about $20 an ounce silver to talking about getting silver at spot to talking about a coin that I just picked up for the very first time, my very first Queen's Beast. So a couple different things all crammed into one video, but hopefully the video was informative or let you guys know that you can pick up that 10 ounce bar if you didn't already know. So head on down to the comments and let me know if you already have a silver gold bull 10 ounce silver bar if you have any queen's beast coins and what are your thoughts on the spot price of silver being just a hair under 20 dollars an ounce who knows by the time i post this video by the time i finish filming it by the time i edit it by the time i get it up onto youtube who knows maybe silver is going to be over 20 bucks let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button. If you guys like me, make sure to subscribe. New videos every single day, 365 days a year. Also subscribe to my second channel, which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content. Brand new video over there. Go check it out. The link will be in the description. Trying to hit 2,000 subscribers and we just hit 1,000. I appreciate that. The link will be in the description. And if you want to help support the channel in the biggest possible way, 
Please consider getting yourself some DYDSS merchandise. Of course, we have some precious metal themed t-shirts and hoodies, which are up for grabs, along with a ton of other products, t-shirts, hoodies, even stickers, many of which are raising funds and awareness for different charity organizations. And of course, we have the major cheese ball t-shirt, hoodie, sticker, and coffee mug as well, because evidently, if you carry a silver coin with you in your pocket, apparently that makes you a major cheese ball. And the brand new Kraken Stackin' t-shirt, hoodie, sticker, and coffee mug as well, which was inspired by the silver Kraken coin. I liked it so much I had to come up with some merchandise inspired by it, and a portion of the proceeds for this particular design is going to be going to an ocean cleanup charity organization at no additional cost to you. Comes out of my pocket, not yours. Any and all merchandise can be found by clicking the first link in the description section down below. Thank you in advance. It's more than appreciated. And once again, I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know what are your thoughts on $20 an ounce silver. I didn't think we were going to see $20 silver, but by the way things are looking, it might actually happen. It might happen today. It might happen this week. Or it could be a false alarm and it starts dropping back down into the $19, $18, $17 dollar range. Who knows? Silver is very very sporadic but let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below and anything and everything related to your opinions on the silver gold 10 ounce silver bar or the queen's beast coin series set collection let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you tomorrow and remember don't you dare stop smiling peace